So, we had family come and visit, and of course, none of my family could come because they're all conspiracy theorists and they don't get the damn vaccine. <laughs> I'm like Lonely Joe. <laughs> and my mate Jeremy arrived. And, um, <laughs> and it just, it hit me. I didn't show it because I don't, I don't crack easily like that. But um, Jeremy left a message on my phone as I left the day before I came here. Just literally crapping on me for allowing myself to get sucked so far down the rabbit hole in terms of my own will to live. Because I, I, gave, I give too much of myself to the wrong people and I, I expect to be treated the same way in return and I don't. So when I say that I was ready for oblivion, and believe me, I've survived a lot, a lot. But I just, I, I lost the will to live. So when I came in here, I didn't know which way I was gonna go. I, I just, it was the first positive thing to happen to me in like a year and a half. And uh, you people have restored my faith in humanity. And I didn't quite expect that. And I, I got to experience little parts of pers my personality that I've lost through all of you. And I just, I, I've learned without a shadow of a doubt that I am worth loving and I'm worth mm. receiving the care that I give. Mm.